Am I looking, you know, like in, you know, when I look at the camera? Sorry, can I just take this thing up? Because that was in my ass. Just like, oh, what, what a debacle this has been. If, if I'd have named the route, I would have called it two steps forward, one step back. So like, let's just say that. Trying to get the back lift, there we go. Yep. Trying to fall down and die. The whole thing started, I guess, when I was chatting to, to Mike and I was like, hey Mike, there's this massive sea cliff in Sicily. I'm like, it looks looks flipping awesome. <laughs> uh, and it would be like, I might, I might go do it. Seb said that you have this plan to go and bolt a 300 meter sea cliff, which sounded awesome. It just went from, from there to, oh, hey man, I've got, I've, got, I've got an FPV contract. I'm like, what the f Oh my God, oh my God, this is pretty big. Uh, yeah, we turned up, got messed about with a higher car, that was uh, the first one. Then we had to wait for ages for the bolts, and then we had to wait again because the ropes hadn't turned up. The bolts came in like a, a week and a half later, the ropes came in a week and a half later. We got shafted at here, there and everywhere by everything. Then we went and looked at the crag. And the guidebook only had, in the whole cliff, maybe five or six routes in it. And the first line we looked at was really horrible to protect on the top. It's just going to be a huge sort of undertaking with loads of different like things that we don't know about. So that got poo-pooed. <laughs> we didn't do that. So we moved from there and we sort of was like, oh, you know, this is Crag nearby. Uh, it should be quite easy access. Then we went and looked at a different line, but that line had this massive block on top, which may or may not have fallen on our heads and killed us, or like trundled through a school. Couldn't happen. Uh, so that was awful. Why, why is this tree also? Ah! There was a beautiful corner that I thought, oh wow, that could do with a line. As, as, I, as I came down the, the corner, uh, I started spotting incredibly rusty bolts. So that was no good. Oh God. Uh, we found some routes that go... Okay, where in this cliff do we find a single pitch with a flat top so we don't have to do the whole dynamics of... We have to... Anyway, there's a lot of nonsense. I seem to spend like 50% of my time trying to work out what the hell's going on. You know, the more that we looked at it, the more complicated that looked like it was going to be, particularly because, unbeknownst to me anyway, the top of the crag has a lot of really, really sharp rock. It's essentially like a conglomerate of blades ready to kill you. This this is our super high-tech rope protector. Just gonna keep the boys safe. It's high, yeah, it's it's uh, it's clearly, it's dual density, it's yellow on the outside and black on the inside. Snake! Ah! <laughs> it, was, it just appeared, I was stumbling across, it appeared to me, it's kind of like, oh yes! This is, this is gonna be good. Um, and that next saga started. <laughs> I can't breathe anymore. Yeah. You don't need to breathe. I can. <laughs> oh, I'm really like. <laughs> <laughs> I think I may have picked the wrong partner for the um, for the trip. It's not actually on the climb. It's from Paradise. So you can you cannot go off that way. that has gone to talk to the other Sicilian people. We've been sent away because we're not suitable for meeting his friends. I just wished I knew that before the trip. Bollocks. <laughs> like if I do, if I go do something, I like to know what I'm what I'm doing in a way. I don't want all the answers to everything. That's you know that's just not possible. But on the other hand, I found that Zeeman was a was almost the opposite. I'm pretty noisy. I run around a lot and I shout and scream and holler and giggle and laugh and, and joke. Seb's very 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 serious. I like to have a good a good idea of. of sort of do's and don'ts and a bit lame <laughs> Pornhub will be totally into this is this like bondage adventure outdoor amateur I'm done with absolutely on them I'll push you on the swing yeah. you, you can relax <laughs> <laughs> mm. we had a nice day 
But, but maybe there's a reason there's no roots there. Because it's wank. This is wank. <laughs> In all honesty, I feel like at some point, somewhere down the line, Seb's decided that I'm a useless liability. <laughs> Essentially, I found that he, we, we differentiated by, I was maybe being quite, quite careful about stuff. Whether he... <laughs> I, I'm, not, I'm not down with that, essentially. I like, I love climbing, I love the risk in it and all the rest, but where I, where I, can, where I can mitigate and minimize the risk, it's like, that, that's why I do it. Because I, I, I know I can, I can keep myself as safe as possible. Sometimes it's just, you know, it's not very safe, but... I know that I, I, I sort of own that to myself. Yeah. But sort of off the back of that, he just got more and more like anything I said was no good. Uh, and we just weren't really able to communicate with each other. Are we friends again? No. Oh, come on! What if I buy you a gelato? What? On the budget money. Hi. <laughs> There was a lot of pressure I started building up in the team, a lot of friction I started building up in the team. Yeah. Ah! Oh. We're, uh, we're multi-pitching and uh, I picked a tiny, tiny ledge to belay from. Uh, and I'm not sure Seb's going to talk to me anymore. <laughs> That's stupid. What is this? <laughs> what is this? You want it? Oh, before that, like, you know, I've done i the odd multi-pitch years ago, but I'm not super hot on that stuff. And then, the worst climbers in the world <laughs> proceeded to get shut down. <laughs> so then, the third or fourth option was the line that we actually did, which was mostly chosen because it seemed like the most achievable, because by that point we were like two weeks into three weeks of, of being here, and we had nothing to really show for it, apart from a bunch of like dead ends. Like, that one doesn't work, that one doesn't work, that one. I felt massive amounts of pressure, not because not because it was filmed, but because uh, Mike was here to to film. It was here. It's here to work and to produce something for someone else. You know, this had to be a hard route. Just something like good footage. Oh. Now I felt a lot of pressure for sure. Uh, he did leave me a few bolts. <laughs> I'm not terribly happy with some of his work. Um, Man's not hot. Man's not. I am. Hot. As hot. Here it comes. It's done. It's finished. Let's climb it. I thought it was going to be much more of a holiday than it was, but in between endless hiking up scree slopes and falling over and rigging and unrigging and whatever, it's been a... Oh boy, it's been an experience. Ah, <laughs> it's been pretty average, isn't it? Uh, I've, I've been I've been asking myself why did it go so tits up? Like why why? I did think before the trip I was sort of kept, I kept asking myself in a way because I knew he wasn't super experienced. I kept asking myself what what is he doing here? Why 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 am I taking him? What is is this our trip? But he can't. Uh, I just learned that you need to pick the right people for what you want to do. That's the hardest part. I try to keep myself together for a long time, trying to keep tensions down in myself. Go for it. Oh yeah, uh, rotten culo. Oh, uh, it means that you had enough, uh, you made enough love with your partner from the back door that your back door is broken now.
Yeah, this is very much rotten culo. I'm kind of trying to put a positive spin on things because no one really wants to hear, you know, we went here and it was hard work for three weeks and uh, we're kind of leaving with, with a much lesser route than we wanted, uh, having learned nothing. <laughs> like, like we haven't learned anything, have we? All we really know is that like limestone is sharp. If yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. I feel pooped. I'm roasted. Never yeah, worked so hard at this temperature in my life. I've never stood in the sun so hard in my life. <laughs> <laughs> I've never stood in the sun so hard. Uh, the next step is finding the right partner and we go climb the sea cliff together because that line is still not bolted. Eventually, eventually we will make a video about a successful trip. Third time lucky, yeah. Third time is the charm. Oi, oi, he's got a low gun. Today on Climbing Day! Welcome to Epic today we're Hello and welcome to Daily Climbing. Hello and welcome to Epic Today we're on Tinder. Welcome to Tom Daily. <laughs> welcome to Epic Daily. Today. Welcome to kicking cactus on top of your friends. <laughs> <laughs>